When you order product from TrepStar.com, it typically comes in one of three ways. Either in a DVD case like this, or in a, in a sleeve, a safety sleeve here with a little cloth backer. Or it can come in a CD case like this, also called a jewel case. What the customer receives in the case of a single disc like this, if they order, if you order it in an envelope mailer, which is our most economical, we can actually send it at one ounce, which is still a postage stamp. It's handled as a letter, and what we use is a just a standard A7 envelope, and their shipping address would go on that, and it would be sent as this. We'll show some pictures of it with a label later, but this is actually surprisingly doesn't get that much breakage because it's handled as a letter instead of a parcel. They don't drop boxes on the letters. They keep them separate. So we know that these actually get through pretty well, even though it's just in a thin envelope. If Net Netflix sends you packages like this, if you've ever used Netflix, and they're rarely broken. Now with the CD, standard CD case, what we have is a, what's called a two panel insert and what we do is your artwork would have two panels actually and it's just it would look like this and when we fold it we insert it into the CD case and then it becomes a two panel. I did that backwards but you get the idea. And then the CD case locks in the disc like this. Now these are 100% new material um, so they're somewhat flexible. We normally would mail these in a bubble mailer, a white bubble mailer like this, and the postage label would be on top of that and shipped out. You also have the option to insert, you, once you go through packaging options, you can actually pick, pick a box like this, which is a little more durable and resists breakage a little more. The problem, the reason why we don't always send it in a box is because it goes over four ounces and it becomes the five ounce rate, which gets heavier and costs more and it would cause us to raise the prices. So by default it goes in the bubble mailer. Now I'm gonna with both the single sleeve you can order multiple quantities of any of this but with a DVD case we have a couple of options because in this case it's a single DVD case and this has a very good hub right here. It's hard for the discs to come off. It's very flexible 100% new material you can print an insert card. It's only on one side. It's kind of a glossy card stock. This is all we offer though. You don't have to include this, but it's the same price whether you do or you don't. And then here's your DVD case over app, which is printed and cut. It's kind of a glossy stock, and that's inserted into the sleeve here. And that's what a single disc case looks like. Once again, that would be placed in a bubble mailer. Shipment. If you pick options, you also have the choice of in having your DVD case go into our little box like this. And what that would be would be uh, an additional charge. Actually, I did this backwards. The way this works is you fold it down like this, and then it will be shipped and taped like that. So you have an option to pick a DVD case box mailer like this. That's a little additional cost because, again, it goes over four ounces. But you do have the option to ship it in a box instead of a bubble mailer. Now we're going to continue on with what we offer, a multi-disc set. This is an example of a multi-disc set. If you look at this, it has four discs in it. It's on a hub, so if I remove them from the hub, you can kind of see it has some depth to it, the hub area. And the four discs are just placed on the hub. This is a 100% new material case. It's very flexible, holds up well in the mail. That's important because in a bubble mailer, things are getting flexed and moved around a little. And these don't crack that much and the discs don't come out. They, they, they hold up really well. The CD cases don't hold up as well, so that's where you might want to consider putting it in a box. But that's really up to you. Finally, we're going to look at our options for two and three disc DVD cases. We don't offer four, five, and six because we don't want to stock 
all kinds of different product. We only most common is two disc sets or three disc sets. Anything over that we put in the hub cases. So these are exactly the same standard size DVD case as the six disc set, the one we just saw that holds up to six, or this one holds exactly two. And with this, there could be room for a printed insert card as well over here. This one just didn't happen to have that. And this is a very nice, what's called an Amore case brand. Amore is the brand name for a particular type of DVD case, so it's a very high quality case for the two disc set. So if you have exactly two discs, you can choose between the hub case, which is a little less cost to you, or this exact two disc set. That's within packaging options as well. Once you set up your product, you can go through package options and pick some of these things. Here's an example of a three disc set. This one has the insert card. Once again, it's the same size no matter if it's a one disc set or a multi disc set. And it has one, two, three discs in this one. So in this case, the center fold has two. It's again, it's an Amory brand case. It holds the disc in well so they don't pop out during shipment. They're flexible, 100% new material. The key with shipping individual product like that is you want them to be 100% new material so they're flexible enough to take a little bit of a beating, whether it be in the bubble mailer or the boxes. And no matter what, I said, for DVD cases, for multi-disc sets, we don't offer a CD case or a jewel case. So if you, have, if you insist on it being in a CD case, you're going to have to make individual single-disc products and then order them all together as a set. Like, for example, you could order three, you know, Project A, B, and C of this, and it would all ship in the same box. But if you want it to cost less for you, you could make, in this case, was a four-disc set. It's in a hub stackable case, and it, uh, that's a lot less money, less weight, less volume of packaging. But no matter what, for multi-disc sets, it has to go in a DVD case. So it could be the two-disc set, the three-disc set, or the up to six. And if you had more than six, it would be two of these, or three of these. You could call it volume one, two, and three. So that's what the customer gets. You can choose between a bubble mailer or a box, or a sleeve and an envelope. Thank you.